I'm the uh, the grandpa of the team, it seems like. But um, you know, the past couple of years have been just indescribable. It's been had some good moments, had some bad moments, but within everything starting, I've learned to grow up. I learned to take charge, take care of everything that needs to be done, understand what it means to be responsible, and have a lot of fun along the way. No, I mean it really doesn't hit me. It's like you know, you know, yeah, it's my last meet, last dual meet as a volunteer. But once I leave here, I'm still gonna be a vol. I'm always gonna be a vol. I'm always gonna consider that 10 meters, three meters, one meter, this place as one of my homes. And my year's not done. I still have SECs, I still have NCAAs. So it might be the end of my dual meet, regular season, whatever, but it's by far not the end for me. Uh, Dave has brought me up ever since I've been little. It's gonna be hard leaving him. It's gonna be hard leaving everything here. At the same time, Dave talks so highly about his past divers, and I know I'm gonna be one of those people He's always going to talk about, like, I gave Mike two weeks to learn this big dive. I know he can do it. I know you can do it. I want to see it done. So he's, you know, he's been able to, to pass on his, his, the experiences that he's had to the younger guys on the team. Um, and just, you know, to bring on that patience, which, which is when you get to the big championship meets, patience and competition is, is huge. And the younger guys kind of, can easily forget that and having somebody like Mike around can really help him partly actually tease him about being the old man on the team. We have a nickname for him. His nickname is Madala, which in, 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 in the Shona African language means old man. And so, um, so I call him Madala and he kind of enjoys that because I think he, and it's a respectful term uh, in, in, in that language and, uh, he, and, he, and, he, and I use it respectfully for him. Well, when I first came here, I was, you know, well, signing a rafters, you know, that's that's all good. It didn't mean anything to me then. Now it means, you know, my name is here. It's been here. And then people are going to go up there, they're going to read my name. You know, five years from now, freshmen will walk in, they're going to see those signatures up there and be like, wow, these guys knew what they were doing. They're going to see Captain Scary written up there. And they're going to just know what I've done and where I've been. And hopefully it'll take that and run with it and make this team better.